Have you watched any of the uh, the Ultimate Fighter? I've seen I've seen like that show before, but like I haven't like I don't keep up with it. Cause uh, McGregor's on this year. I saw him knock out the the mascot. That was bad. Yeah. The mascot went to the hospital after. Yeah. Oh, I just watched that in the other room. He knocked the mascot out, right? So it was like kind of a setup thing. So he goes out and hits him, right? But I don't think the follow up shot was planned. I don't think so either. And he didn't have to punch him as hard as he could. No, he didn't. We really didn't. And then the mascot. Most of the time, it's just like a kid in there. Yeah, I like that the mascot is like unconscious, essentially. And McGregor's spraying the title spray on him. That's yeah. tough. I mean, McGregor's got some problems now. But you send out a drunk, coked out man to punch a mascot. Yeah, he's been drunk for a while now. Yeah. <laughs> He is on like a fucking... He's on a bender. How old was he when he fought Floyd? 28, 29? Yeah. So he's been on a six-year bender? When's the last time he fought? It would be Poirier. Yeah, it was when he broke his leg. That was what, last year? I think that was two years ago. It was the d- day of the Queen of Heaven Carnival on a Saturday. Yeah. I could, t- I could tell you that. Because you were pissed. I remember rushing to the bar, and it was after the uh, first round. And then being near tears. Like, he broke his leg, and I broke my heart that day. He, uh, yeah, he lost. He got bitched on that. Yeah, the mascot went to the ER. Yeah, he got sent out with pain pills. Is it just, some guys have all the luck, yeah. right? <laughs>